the victim witness decision. Okay, may I have your name? Claudia Arnett. Okay, I'm trying to get in witness protection. I've been trying to get in witness protection a while. Um, there's multiple. We don't have a search thing as witness protection. Oh, what did it, what did I call? This is victim witness, so we deal with uh, your victim rights, your victim packet. Oh, well, that, that would be awesome. Victim, we don't have a such thing as victim uh, victim whatever you just said. That's federal. Okay. Well, how can you assist me? Because I have multiple parties covering up for my abuse. I have a stalker that the police are refusing to investigate. You would need to talk with uh, one of the law enforcement uh, people on duty. But all of our cases come from law enforcement. So why are they not doing the, the report? I don't know. Um, what is What do you do there again? When the cases... I mean, what is your position? Okay, I thought I called a victim coordinator. I'm the victim coordinator, and I'm trying to tell you what I do. Okay, so if... I don't, I don't help with the law enforcement piece of it. Okay, well, how can you assist me with that going on? What can I do, and how can I get, get services from you? You can, you can apply for crime victim compensation. Okay, you're a Dallas County victim coordinator, and you want me to apply for uh, crime victim's compensation? What do I do about stalking and protection orders and uh, advocate for that? I would, have to, I would have to refer you to law enforcement. We have law enforcement here. Let me give you the main number. Okay. Or I can transfer you. Okay. So here's the I problem. I don't know with, with the other. You have to have a report. So it has to begin with law enforcement. So we have detectives here that you can talk with. 214. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. I'm just trying to dissect. So you're, because all of the victim coordinators I call with my phone refer me back to the police department. Multiple parties, my telephone company, everybody refers me to the corrupt police. So I haven't been getting anything resolved for years. I just uh, don't understand why a victim police, coordinator our, wouldn't our want me to know how to talk. Our police people here are detectives, but they came from police department. I'm, I'm pressed for time. I'm sorry, I'm on my lunch break. I wanted to know why victim coordinators keep referring me back to the police. If you're a victim coordinator, or can you call the police? Uh, we, don't, we don't handle the law enforcement piece of it. Two, let me give you the number. I, I just number. want a service. I, every, I keep getting forwarded back over to the police. So I'm trying to see if you're a victim coordinator. Why won't you give me assistance? Because I can't get it anywhere. I'm just trying to get to the bottom of why. I don't handle, I don't handle what you just asked for. Okay, well, what do you handle? Because you're not giving me anything. Is there any services that you're willing to give me as a victim coordinator? You didn't tell me how to combat stalking. You didn't con tell me how to combat police corruption. No party will. Then you need to advocate for me and have call the police department to see why they won't investigate 60 something reports. I'm not sure if I can help you at all. As a victim coordinator, you can't help me? Not with what you just asked for. Oh, uh, well, what can you do? I just mentioned to you I can assist you with the crime victim compensation. You can apply for that, but you would still have other issues that you need to resolve. But you have to start with the detective. So if you don't go through the law enforcement of your agency or your local area where you live, you can talk with our detectives here. Because Why didn't you recommend a protection order, ma'am? Or any kind of thing to protect myself as a victim like coordinator? That we're dealing with stalking. So that's one avenue that can assist you. If you don't want that, that's fine. But that's I don't know why you're not advocating for me properly. You didn't recommend that I get a protection order or anything on how to combat myself from stalking and protect myself. I just called you out the blue and everyone else that I call out the blue that denies me education. I don't know why this happens, ma'am. So are you a victim coordinator? I don't either. I don't know why it happens either. I can't answer that question. Okay, well, can you assist me with the services and, you know, and tell I you? Can take, I can take your name and number and have someone call you. Okay, you're the victim coordinator and you can't assist? Not at this time, not with what you just asked for. What's your name? Okay, you haven't given me any education, ma'am. Any education at all. Are you there? What's your name? Okay, so who are you referring me to? Can we start with your name? It's Kiana, K-E-Y-A-N-A. -A. Okay, Miss Kiana, what's your last name? Clark, C-L-A-R-K. And what's your callback phone number? 
so I can try to find help for you and call you back. Okay. So hold on one moment. So you're the victim coordinator and you can't help me? You just said you needed help with stalking. Okay. And so what, else was it? so what do you do? What do you help with? So you won't have to refer me to anyone else. I can help you with crime victims compensation. Have you applied for that? probably haven't if you have if you don't have a case i have but i had some weird things going on with it they are giving me a hard time and won't give me any assistance whoever i'm talking to on my phone but i can find someone who can give you assistance but i need your i don't know why you, you know you're a victim coordinator phone. and you haven't given me any education as well as all the victim coordinators that i call I don't know why you did not dis uh, say that you could call the police and see why they're not investigating 60 something reports no, that's as a victim not coordinator. That, no, that's police, the police uh, folks, the police law enforcement have their own victim coordinator. Each department, each law enforcement office has their own victim person and each one does something a little bit different. What area? Are you having the issue with what department? I mean, each place I call, each place I call, I just each I I call multiple places on my phone. Uh, advocacy. Places that you call. I called uh, at places that are supposed to be giving me assistance with uh, children, crimes against children. They did not assistance. All of them that I call, um, there are no CPS won't tell me about programs and denies investigation for child abuse. But I, I just call all these numbers and they're all denying me services and refer me back to the police. So I don't know how I'm going to ever get victims advocacy if they want the police to be involved. Before it got so chaotic, victims advocates didn't guard and enforce that the police department was behind them giving me support and assistance. Now all these places I call want the police to set it up, which are criminals, the ones that I come in contact with. So it's not happening. But before the police got involved, it wasn't a requirement that the police uh, file reports that they're not filing for me to get advocacy. Now no one will advocate for me because they need the police to okay it. And they're not going to okay their, the crimes that they're committing from, for me to get support with it. I just don't understand why all the advocates now that all of this chaos has transpired require that I have um, police, you know, assist with their giving me um, services. To my knowledge, what I thought was you're supposed to advocate and give me, if a person was requesting services, you're supposed to call the police and see why they're not investigating these reports. But the advocate, advocates have changed their procedure and why it require cases, which doesn't make sense. But I'm on my lunch break, so someone will call me back and deny services. I'm sorry, someone will call me back. I don't, I will just want an advocate that'll get help, call the police department and see why they're not following um, through with all these police, investigating all these police reports. Okay, we can get, I'll ask one of our detectives to Why, you. what, I've already called all the detectives, they denied services. I don't you know why an advocate. The here. You didn't know the number. And then you didn't take the number. I've called detectives for the DA, Family Violence, Child Abuse Division. I've talked to the DA. Who'd you talk with? I talked to, um, Timothy or something. I just want to know why the advocates are being guarded. Why can't an advocate just advocate for me everywhere I call? Okay, thank you. You have someone call me back? I'm going to try. Yes, ma'am. Why would you have to try? Because that's what you do when you're looking and searching for help and advocating for someone. Sure, ma'am. Thank you. The right people at the right place at the right time for the right situation. Sure. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Clark. Hello, this is Kiana. May I have your name? Yes, 